I'm Mike, N2MAK, and today we're at Harriet Hollister Spencer State Park to do a QRP Parks on the Air activation. It's not too bad of a hike up to where we'll be doing the activation from today, and it's an amazing spot. It's gorgeous out, and I really wanted to come here today, and you'll see why. If it looks like I'm using a ground rod as a hiking stick, that's because I am. I purchased it on Amazon a few years ago after I got my license, thinking I'd actually put it in the ground at parks when activating. Well, that never happened, so I put a mirror mount on it, and I've used it a few times to quickly put up a vertical uh, whip, uh, even the Wolf River coil. I thought I'd give it a try today. All right, here we are. Take a look at where we'll be activating from. What a view. There's something you don't see every day at a POTA activation. You bet. Have a great day. All right, it's time to get set up and get this park activated. There was no snow at my house when I left this morning, which is about 40 minutes away. So I was not expecting snow and frozen ground when I got here, but I probably should have since we're about 2000 feet up here. So for the antenna, we got the Wolf River Coils 213 inch whip. That'll do 10 through uh, 20. Um, also got uh, some speaker wires for radials with alligator clips and uh, some handy paracord that's got knots tied in it at uh, the approximate points for the different bands, whether it's 10, 12, 15, 17, 20. I thought I'd start out on 17 meters and measured the whip out accordingly. But when I set it up, I checked the SWR in 17 meters and it was way off. So I checked it on the other bands before adjusting it and here's what happened. All right, so we're on 20 meters. Go to check the SWR and you see it's pretty low, which is great. What's odd is that the whip isn't Extended the full way for 20, but I'm guessing that that has something to do with the copper ground rod. CQ Poda, CQ Poda, CQ Poda. This is November 2, Mike Alpha Kilo calling CQ for Parks on the Air from Park Kilo 8623 in Western New York. CQ Poda, CQ Poda, CQ Poda. This is November 2, Mike Alpha Kilo, Parks on the Air. Standing by for any stations anywhere. Kilo America 7, Tango X ray Sugar. November Echo 4, Tango in November. The Charlie Uniform 3, Hotel a Yankee, you're a 5-5, five five, QSL. QSL, QSL, Mike, I haven't worked you in a while. Good to get you in the log, especially QRP. Roger, roger, Mike. All the best, 7-3, great job. Kilo Delta 2, Yankee Echo India. Awesome, awesome. Well, thank you for answering my call. It's I, I, I tend to try to call out on uh, on two meters after doing a HF POTA um, if I'm up high like I am now. And in fact, I remember I got you in the log one time from my HT when I was at Bear Hill uh, down off of uh, Canadagua. Back to you. Uh, yes, I remember that. I, I thought the uh, call sign was very familiar. So we were able to make a two meter uh, simplex contact uh, at the end of the activation with the uh, signal stick antenna. Do you see it's uh, slightly limp here in the cold, but worked fine, got the job done. All right, that was an uh, awesome activation. We got 35 contacts in the log on 20 meters. It was an unconventional setup, but it worked well. And then uh, got one contact on two meters using the uh, signal stick antenna. So that was a lot of fun. And uh, it's places like this when, when people ask, uh, why are you going out to play radio in parks? It's it's because of places like this. This is just awesome. It was a gorgeous day and an amazing view. I don't want to leave, but I got to. Uh, if you like what you see, uh, click like, comment down below, and uh, subscribe to my channel. I'd appreciate it. I'm Mike, N2MAK, 73.